Hey gangsters, it's just me again. Oh mama. Or Leslie Singh. However you know me. Anyway, I'm trying to do my vlogmas mukbang. And I don't know if I can. Because it's always like interruptions. So anyway, this is what we're having. Yes, look at all those wonderful carbs. This is chicken and rice. Well, this is the rice. I got a little pat of butter in here. And that's my chicken. What I did is I baked my chicken first and then got it all nice and done and looking all pretty. And then I, with the juice that came off of it, or I should say chicken grease, I put rice in there and water and a little bit more seasoning and some uh, bell pepper and onion, onion in there. It's really good. I'd say it tastes like Spanish rice, but not really, because I don't have any, like, um, Spanish rice flavoring in it. So it snowed here today. I'm not talking little snow. I'm talking kind of big snow, and it's still snowing. This is hot. Mm. I feel bad about eating ordinary food. Because I was supposed to just have vegetables and meat today, but I'm just eating a regular type of stuff. But I'm watching out for my calories, though. I'm not going to eat like a billion calories in one day. Mm -mm. I would think this is about a cup of rice. That's what I think. And that's one chicken thigh. It has bones in it. Which I think there's more flavor in the chicken that has bones. Because when I buy the, I call them the flash frozen chicken breasts at Walmart. <coughs> They're so tough. And I can cook them all day in the crock pot, put meat tenderizer on it, and it's still really tough. I'm holding the camera with my right hand. I'm left-handed, and I'm eating. So... I'm watching TV again. Watching more little people. And there's another little people there. The dog. He always wants my food. And that's about it. Today was just filled with watching it snow. Staying in the house. Not a whole lot of anything today. And every time I try to watch a YouTube video, I don't know what happens. I lose interest or something. Get up there, Tippy. Hurry up. Oh, he had to make the cat jump down first. Mm. Num num. That's really pretty golden, huh? For the chicken, what I did is I put um, seasoning on. I put garlic salt and onion powder. A little bit of um, meat tenderizer, some pepper, and some paprika, and a little tablespoon of oil. I rolled all that chicken, you know, around in a little tablespoon of oil with all these seasonings, and I baked it. It always comes out pretty. It'd be good to have cranberries with this. So, I'm not really up on current events because events because I haven't been watching the news. I have no idea what's going on out there in the world. I need to like get current with stuff.
Ooh, hot, 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 hot. Mm. So I have a question, guys. Do you think that Nikki Avocado's like making new videos or that what he's putting up are they like old? Because like they don't match up with what he says on Instagram and stuff. So I don't know. Like I seen a video with him recently with Hungry Fat Chick. So I wonder if he came to Nevada. That's where I am, but I'm not in Vegas. I'm in northern Nevada. I mean, obviously he did come to Nevada, but when did he come? Because the, the videos with Hungry Fat Chick, they were like months ago. Now I'm saying he's got more. I don't know. I can't keep up with where these people are. But I don't eat that gristle. Mm -mm -mm. He says I will. Yeah, I don't. I don't eat the gristle and the reports. I, I watch somebody eat the mukbang and they're like chewing the end of the bone and ooh. I don't think I could do that. I'm not that damn hungry. I'm gonna make it a mess on my shirt. So the little people on here, this little people show, they want to go visit an orphanage, I think. And they're all... I guess the, the little people are like giving the kids experience because a couple of those kids are adopted. They're not really their kids. So that'll be, you know, cool for them to see, you know, different stuff. Chicken skin. They're their little mixed match family. You know what I should do? I should put the news on so I can talk about current events while I'm doing this. I don't know where my remote is. Though. I've seen Walmart's got some really good sales. Super S good sales. On toys and stuff. I still haven't got to go shopping. I was going to try to go shopping today, but we just, uh, it got nasty outside, so we stayed home. Duty bug and duty bug's mama. I guess they decide they're going to eat now, too. That's good. Duty Bug's been picking out today. She had a piece of pizza. Now she's eating an orange. Now she's eating an orange. She's had a muffin with uh, with peanut butter on it. With some Fritos. Uh, let's see what else did she have. Apple slices with more peanut butter on them. She's had a whole bunch of different stuff today. And she's still hungry. I think it's because the weather's cold. Oh, Tippy. Tippy's begging. Oh, look. 
I like Little Caesars. I got a hair in my mouth. I think I do. Feels like I do, but I don't. Hmm. That's gross. There's one of my hairs, too. So does anybody out there get depressed around the holidays? The holidays can be depressing. Can you believe it? My beverage is coffee tonight. I was cold earlier. I made a cup of coffee and I forgot about it. And I have one of these really cool insulated cups. My coffee's still really warm. It's like just right kind of warm now. That song is in my head called Tell Me Something Good by Rufus. You know that song, Tell Me Something Good? You gotta tell me something good. Let's have a praise report. <clears throat> if you have something good that happened in your life or something, tell me something good. Leave in the comments something good. I really need to hear something good. I am the best eater in the whole world. Mm, nom nom nom. All gone. And naturally, Tippy wants a bone, but <clears throat> they say you shouldn't give dogs, like, bones because they're, like, well, he's going to get this gristle thing. Because they, they get splinters off into their stomach and stuff like that. So he's not getting that bone. I used to give my dogs all kinds of stuff, even grapes. Can you believe that? The one dog that I used to have is fun because she would catch the grapes in her mouth and then about two years ago I found out grapes are poisonous for dogs. What happened? <laughs> she didn't seem to die from grapes. Me and her would sit down and polish off a whole big old bowl of grapes, like a cereal bowl full of grapes, like two or three cups of grapes. I'd be here, here, dog, and she <laughs> biting them. She never got sick. That dog and him... One time when I went out, it was like around this time of the year, I had um, bought those, you know those like uh, clear candy canes? It's like a, and then they have like the Hershey's Kisses in them. Well, I had bought one of those for my, my son and I had it like under the Christmas tree. Well, guess what happened? The dogs got into it and it looked like a human got into it because it was on the couch, opened up like a human would open up. And all the little Hershey Kisses were, the papers were on the floor and all over the couch and stuff like that. But the dogs had got into it. I mean, it just looked like a human. And I thought, oh my God, because I knew that, that um, chocolate will poison dogs. It, like, crystallizes their kidneys like grapes because they can't, like, you know, it just doesn't go through their system. Anyhow, long story short, called a bunch of vets. They said, oh my God, what kind of chocolate? Well, it was milk chocolate. How much did they eat? Oh, maybe about a pound of it. That's why I said, I said, oh my God, bring the dog in. And I'm at the time, oh my God, I don't have any money. And they're refusing to help me and all this stuff. So I'm like, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? So 
but my dogs never got sick. You know, I'm not telling you to give your dogs chocolate because I will not give my dog chocolate, but my dogs didn't get sick. You know, and all the chocolate they ate, I sh sure the hell sh should have lost them, you know, because they ate a lot of chocolate. The whole damn thing. The whole, the whole candy cane thing. Like about a pound and a half of Hershey Kisses. Well, it'd be like a bag. You know the bags of Hershey Kisses they sell? It's like a whole bag like full of that only in this long, clear plastic candy cane thing. Yeah, but they're okay. Well, Jaja's gone because she's old. But this one, he's just fine. He's so cute. Look at that face. He's trying to give me subliminal messages. Give me chicken bones. Give me chicken bones. But he's not going to get it. Okay, gang. I'll show you my cup. This is my nice um, thermal coffee cup. It's made by Buffalo. I paid like $9 for this cup like a couple years ago. And it's a really nice cup. And it keeps things warm. It doesn't do such a cool, cool job of keeping things cool, though. But it'll keep things hot for like hours. I'm not kidding. Mm. Yummy coffee. I have like chocolate caramel coffee creamer in this. Mm. My dessert. Okay, gang. Thanks for coming and eating with me. Sorry, my content's kind of boring, but I need to catch up on current events and um, YouTube videos. So I will see you next month, Bank. Hi! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Hello! Hi, she I'm says hi. Oh my god, show them your outfit. Look. You can, are you on camera? Yeah. Look, she's got um. Lord God. Oh my god. And then I get <laughs> I get bombarded by a big old girl. See? I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. They all come to me. Hi, Roxy. Roxy's dad says, come on, Roxy. See? I'm not kidding you. They all come to me. Okay, gang. I'll see you next month, bang, if you choose to come back.